take a ruler and stretch it across the board at an angle and you'll easily find the center of it by dividing the width by two. If my tape measure is at six, three is the center. To add a line on my stock, I'll start off by adding my first mark, flip the tape, and do this on the opposite side, connecting the line with a straight edge. This is an excellent tip I've seen floating around the short universe, but let's take this a step further. If you've ever needed to space screws evenly or make cuts at even exact increments on stock, this tip is for you. Take a ruler or a yardstick and put it on the corner of your stock. We'll move it diagonally across the stock and place it on a number we're looking to divide the board by. In my case, I want to divide it into four equal parts. So I'll put the four inch mark on the opposing edge and add marks at every inch. Now I'll take it to the opposite end and do the same thing again like the first example using my ruler to stretch the lines. Sometimes the board might be too wide, so you might need to use a little math. This board is seven inches wide, but I have to divide it by four. So I'll instead use eight and count by twos to get four equal parts. Seven follow for more bite-sized tips. Keep making things.